I am completely overwhelmed by all of the responses to my walk away video. So thank you. Thank you very much for your support. And thank you to new subscribers. Um, I wanted to follow up with something um, that I thought would be useful in terms of content. You know, there's so much political commentary and there's so much available out there that oftentimes I don't really feel like I have a whole lot to add. But I think I'm going to try something a little bit different, and that is politics and human nature. Um, I don't know whether this will be something that people are interested in or not. Obviously, I didn't think the walk away video um, was that big a deal, but I did think it was important to do it. So um, talking about politics and human nature, I want to just be able to cover some topics um, that can help you in communicating with people about politics because it's become difficult, toxic, poison even. Um, and I just, you know, it's, it's frustrating to see. So I'm just really hoping that the content that I will be creating will help you to um, better communicate, you know, especially those people who maybe don't speak to you, um, who don't like your political ideology, um, that this will help to heal some of what we've been through. Um, the past few years because it's been a lot. So um, just want to give you an idea of some of the topics that I will be covering. So um, we'll see if I can get away with calling this the psychology of politics um, without getting in trouble with anyone. Um, it really is not about, it, it's about human nature, human behavior. Um, and some of the topics that I will be trying to cover are basically tools that people use um, in politics to control us, to get our vote, to keep our vote, um, to basically, you know, get reelected, to make sure that we kind of stay in their camp, on their side, on their team. And it's very similar to what is used in every relationship, or not every, but could be used in any relationship. Um, fear, blame and shame, projection, grooming. Um, uh, projection and grooming are probably two of the most sinister, um, to me, uh, just tactics of manipulation. Um, isolation, gaslighting, um, use and abuse or misuse or lack of empathy, um, revision, revision of history, revision of language, um, aggression um, is a lot of what we're seeing right now with um, the riots and, you know, the sort of intimidation. And so some of these topics are actually so big that I will probably break them into several segments. Um, for some people, this will be really boring. But I think for other people, it'll be kind of that aha moment where you're like, oh my God, that's this person I know or that person I know. And as you have an understanding of these different tactics and the really defense mechanisms and just kind of, you know, natural human behaviors, except you got to manage them properly. You know, you have to have some kind of alternative tools. Some of the those conversations that end up breaking down into just pure either fights or someone saying, I can't talk about this anymore. You'll be able to break through some of that, I hope. Not with everybody, obviously, um, but with a lot of people. So that's kind of what I'll be covering. Um, and so I hope that it will be useful to some people. So again, I just want to say thank you to everyone um, for all of your comments, your likes, and your shares of my walk away video. I appreciate it so much um, for the support of the channel and for me personally. Um, like I said, I don't know whether this content will be for everyone. Um, I'm hoping to upload my first, um, my first content on this particular topic um, probably tomorrow, maybe sooner. And um, that'll be on isolation. And I just hope that it helps someone. It doesn't have to be a lot of people. Maybe it will be um, if it's being done out there and duplicated. Um, I'll be looking to your comments for any feedback or suggestions. So again, just thank you so much. I appreciate all of the feedback.